Hello and welcome to another one of my open box videos. Uh, today I'm very excited to let you know that I just received from Mattel. Uh, I ordered it from their Maddie collector site. It's the Batman cow. Uh, just it's it's an exact replica, like the one that was used by Adam West in the 1966 Batman series. So let's go ahead and give it an open. So I'm going to get my knife here, and I'm going to open this carefully. That's funny, the box kind of looks like it bounced off the truck, so I hope this uh, cow is okay. So I'm going to open this nice and gently, so we don't break anything, or cut anything, rather. Okay, oh wow. Alright. Looks like the cow made it okay. All right, now I'm going to take the cow out of the box here. The packing slip, and it looks like it. It made it okay, but they, it looks like they didn't put a lot of stuffing or paper inside the box to protect it. But it looks like it made it just fine. So here's what the box looks like. It's all white. And again, this back of the box. It's from MaddieCollector.com. It was made by Mattel. And of course, you have the Batman classic TV series logo. And it's the cow. So now we're going to go ahead and open that up. So I'm get my knife. Gently cut on the edge here. Oh, they really seal this thing tight. All right, I'm very excited here. Everything is coming into place here. You can see the that cow right on the side of the box there. It has another box within a box here. And it's really in there tight. Here. Nice and gentle. I don't want to ruin the box. There we go. It's coming out nice and slow. Be careful because I want to make sure everything is in excellent condition. Because I'm only just showing just for this video here. So there we go. There's the, the cow inside its display box. It's got really cool um, the logos and everything, the Batman logos. Uh, you can see how. And then it just has all the, this neat artwork. Just like the TV show all over the box. And now I'm going 
to open the box. Oh wow, look at that. That is beautiful. That is a very nice piece. Very nice. It's a nice, it's actually a dark blue, but because of my light here, it makes the car appear a like a royal blue, but it's actually a dark blue. But it's a very nice uh, display box if you want to display it in your home. And it's also durable. It's got the, the plastic molding to protect the, uh, the cow and keep it uh, dust free. So let's go ahead and lift this helmet out. Oh wow, that's beautiful. Look at that. See, it even has a neck brace. <laughs> No, this is actually for the head, for people with smaller heads, but I guess you could also use this for, like, uh, in case of a whiplash in your Batmobile. Ha, ha, ha. So, and it looks like it's a, sol it's a solid uh, plastic helmet inside there. It looks like it has soft material in there. And this is like a spandex type of nylon. And the ears appear to be plastic as well. And then the nose piece here is also nylon, just like the top of the head here. So this is this is beautiful. I, the reason I bought this piece is I, I like to do a lot of the autograph shows. And I'm a huge Adam West fan. So every now and then I, would, I like to uh, go to like uh, Comic-Con and get my things signed. I had like a Batmobile a die-cast Batmobile at the last show signed by Adam West and Burt Ward but the next show I would love to have them sign this piece here and also this piece is also re uh, really cool for like the cosplay as well so but uh, again I'm very excited I haven't tried it on I'm afraid to try it on because it's it's hot in my place here and I don't want to get sweat on it so I'm gonna Probably end up just putting this away and just uh, save it for uh, the uh, co upcoming Comic Con show. So and it, it also has snaps, so you can snap it around your neck. And these run, you know, about a hundred dollars. And I've actually seen some on. I, I googled uh, the, the like. The cow on, uh, and I guess they have another version. It's it's like three hundred dollars. I guess it's it's a lot better than this one. But this is nice. I mean, it's it's very presentable. Uh, once I get the signature on there, I'm gonna display it in my living room or basement. <laughs> and uh, it, you really can't go wrong with this. It's it's very well done. So. I'm going to put this back in the box there, and there you go, it's just a very nice piece if you're really into the 1960s Batman. Maybe they'll come out with a Catwoman one next, <laughs> that'd be cool. So again, thank you for watching my open box video, and have a great day. Bye-bye.